the pig tail. Let's jump in. Tonight, Mummy and Daddy Pig are going out for a Valentine's Day meal. Uh -huh. Mummy Pig has ordered a taxi. <gasps> it's almost here. Hooray! Oh. Whoa. Oh. You're right awaits, madam. <gasps> oh, um. um. Mummy Pig has accidentally ordered a special taxi called a limousine. <laughs> A limo? How romantic! And Whoa. tickly! <laughs> Where are we off to, sirs and madams? Granny and Grandpa Pig's house, if you please, Miss Rabbit. Pepper and George are going there for dinner. Dinner! <laughs> <laughs> okay, calm down, you two. This music reminds me of Venice. <laughs> what a wonderful trip that was. <gasps> <gasps> now it's a disco <laughs> limo! <laughs> oh! <laughs> we didn't have this in Venice! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Care for a oh. chocolate, Mummy Pig? <laughs> oh, don't mind if I can. Can we have some, Daddy? Chocolate! <laughs> um, okay, but not too many. Oh. Pepper and George love chocolate. <laughs> Maybe a little too much. <laughs> I guess I'll have this one then. <laughs> Can we have the disco music again? Just until Granny and Grandpa's house, please. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Yes! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Oh, yeah. Hi! Happy Disco Valentine's Day, everyone! We. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, we're having a Valentine's Day disco. <laughs> <laughs> It's just like that time in Paris, Grandpa Pig. Everyone <laughs> loves celebrating Valentine's Day, but Mummy and Daddy Pig love their disco limo ride most of all. Today, Peppa and her class are going on a school trip. Hello everyone! Who's ready for a school trip in my lovely new yellow bus? Oh! What happened to your old blue bus, Miss Rabbit? It broke down at the weekend whilst I was taking a nice relaxing drive. Oh dear! Miss Rabbit's bus is unable to race! So it's in the garage for some small repairs. That bus is going to need some big repairs. <laughs> Peppa and her friends have never been on a big yellow bus before. Seatbelt check. Check. Then off we go. <laughs> Whoops. Let's try again. Miss Rabbit isn't used to driving the yellow bus. The yellow bus is a bit fast for Madame Gazelle. Miss Rabbit, can the yellow bus play music? The yellow bus can do lots of things. It can do this, 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 and of course, this. The yellow bus can play music very loudly. Could we 
turn the music down a little bit? Of course, Madam Gazelle. Aww. Why don't we sing a song instead? The yellow bus wheels go round and round. Round and round, round and round. round, and round. The yellow bus wheels go round, round and round. round. All day long. <laughs> Let's play I Spy. Good idea. I spy with my little eye. Something beginning with R. Road? Nope. Nope, it's a really big lorry. Oh, hello, Mr. Ball. Hello. Peppa's playgroup have arrived for their school trip, so it's time to get off the bus. Oh, I wish we could stay on the yellow bus all day. Don't worry. I'll be back in the bus to take you all home later. Everyone likes riding in the big yellow bus. Everyone except Madam Gazelle. <laughs> it's Valentine's Day. Peppa and George are making a special dinner what? for Mummy and Daddy Pig. Grandpa Pig is helping. My goodness. We're making special Valentine's Day pizzas, Granny Pig. Because Valentine's Day is all about showing others that you love them. I know! We can make the pizzas heart-shaped! <laughs> now, we toss the dough up into the air, just like they do in Roma. That's a place in Italy, you know. Aha! Hmm. Whoops! <laughs> just like in Roma. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. We can cover the lumpy bits with some vegetables <gasps> from the garden. Oh. Mummy and Daddy Pig are not sure what's going on. Peppa and George are collecting vegetables. The pizzas are going to have lots of toppings. <laughs> <laughs> Let's take the vegetables inside. Pepper and George add vegetables to their pizza. I know how to make the pizzas even more special. We can add Mummy and Daddy Pig's favourite mm. foods. Good idea, Pepper. What are their favourite foods? <laughs> Spaghetti and chocolate cake. <laughs> Yay! We should make the pizzas look like Mummy and Daddy. Peppa and George make faces with the pizza toppings. <laughs> now they're really special. Oh, George! <laughs> <laughs> Chocolate cake? My favourite! <laughs> dinosaur! A spaghetti dinosaur! Thank you, Pepper and George. <laughs> they look too good to eat. Mummy and Daddy Pig think their Valentine pizzas are very special indeed. Well, hey! Today is Valentine's Day. Daddy Pig loves Valentine's Day. Splendid! We need lots of decorations for Mummy Pig's big surprise. What big surprise? We're going to make a special Valentine's Day surprise for when Mummy Pig comes home. Ooh. <laughs> Better get cracking. Hooray! Peppa and George are having fun making Valentine's Day decorations. And Daddy Pig is having fun hanging the decorations. Uh -huh. But Daddy Pig is not being careful. 
And ta-da! Perfect. Now, what's next? Hmm. Perhaps we should tidy up. Ooh, let's make Valentine's pancakes first. Ah! Pepper, George and Daddy Pig are making yummy heart-shaped pancakes. Ha! Ah, now for the fun bit. Whisking. This is fun. Peppa loves whisking. Peppa really loves whisking. Oh my. Careful. If you make too much mess, we won't have enough mix to make... Valentine's pancakes. Aha. <laughs> Wonderful. Now, we'd better get tidying. But what about a Valentine's card, Daddy? Oh, yes. Daddy Pig isn't sure whether to make the card or tidy up the mess. Quickly now. Peppa and George are helping Daddy Pig make a Valentine's card. But Mummy Pig is almost home. <laughs> and done. Now, just enough time to tidy up before... <laughs> What's going on in here? Happy Valentine's, Valentine's Day. Day! We made you a card. And pancakes. What a lovely surprise. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> Things got a bit messy as we worked, but as a last Valentine's surprise, we'll get tidying up, won't we? <laughs> Mummy Pig loves her Valentine surprise, and Pepper, George and Daddy Pig <laughs> loved making it and cleaning up after it. <laughs> 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 Today, Peppa and her family are visiting the arcade. <laughs> well done! You got a high score. That's because Peppa and I are experts at all of these games. Look at all these tokens, Peppa. If you collect lots of these, you can trade them in for a huge prize. Wow, a prize? Squeak! Look at all these tokens! <laughs> can we play that game next? Of course, Pepper. Mummy Pig is showing Pepper how to play Carrot Bop. She is bopping the carrots whenever they pop up. Bop! 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 <laughs> Would you both like to have a go? Yes, please! More tokens? Does this mean we can get a really big prize, Daddy? Daddy? <laughs> Daddy Pig is playing the dancing game. Daddy Pig loves dancing. Wow! I'm a bit of an oh, expert yeah. at dancing, you know. Your turn, Pepper. Phew, that was fun. But is there a game we can play all together? I know just the game. <laughs> Peppa and her family are playing a balloon game. Whoever fills their balloon with water first wins. Did we get another high score? Yes! Your score was so high that you have all won the jackpot. Now you can trade in all your tokens for a huge prize. Hooray! Let's go! Hello again, Peppa. Here are all our tokens. Can we please have our prize? Of course. With this many tokens, you can get a marvellous, extraordinary, one-of-a-kind pencil. Hooray! A pencil! Peppa.
Peppa loves winning lots of tokens with her family at the arcade. And Peppa really loves her brand new pencil. Hello! Peppa and her family have come to the balloon shop to collect a special balloon for a garden party. Miss Rabbit! Can we have our fancy planet-friendly recyclable balloon? Oh! Wow! The balloon shop is full of balloons. Miss Rabbit? <laughs> bonk. <laughs> bonk. 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 Oh, you found me! I've been lost in the balloon since Tuesday morning. Must be lunchtime by now. It's Wednesday, Miss Rabbit. Oh. Anyway, here are all your fancy, planet-friendly, recyclable balloons. <laughs> ready for the party. All? But we only ordered one. Hmm. Whoa. <laughs> um, it says here 1,000 balloons for Mummy Pig's party. Oh, but we don't need this many and we can't waste them. What do we do? I know. We can share them. Peppa and her family are giving the extra balloons to everyone in town. Oh, thank you. And one for both of you. Here you go. Red balloon. Green one for you. <laughs> Only 992 to go. This is going to take forever. Uh-oh, and we have to go and set up the party. I have a great idea. Grab some balloons and follow me, everyone. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> it is time for the party, and everyone is beginning to arrive. <laughs> Hello, Susie. Here's your balloon. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Miss <laughs> 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 Rabbit has used the balloons to turn the garden party into a balloon party. Miss Rabbit can make anything with a balloon. <laughs> Or anyone. Here you go. <laughs> it looks like me. And this one looks like me. <laughs> this is the balloon red. <laughs> <laughs> <Dazzle>, <laughs> And don't worry if you pop a balloon, because we have lots of extras. Bonk! <gasps> bonk! <laughs> bonk! Bonk! Everyone would have loved Mummy Pig's garden party, but everyone loves the balloon party even more. Welcome oh. to the ice cream shop. It is a very hot day, so Peppa and George are playing ice cream shop. Here you go, oh. Mr. Daddy Pig. Oh, thank you. What would you like, Mrs. Mummy Pig? I'd like a banana split, please. Hooray! Oh. Ooh. What's a banana split, Granny? <laughs> it's a type of dessert. First, we need to cut a banana in half. Nana! Oh, ho, 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 ho. Now we add ice cream. Cherries and whipped cream. Oh. George <laughs> likes adding the ice cream. Careful, don't squish the banana. <laughs> and Peppa really likes adding whipped cream. <laughs> don't forget the cherry on top. Here is your banana split, Mrs. Mummy Pig. <laughs> this looks delicious. Oh, please could I have a Knickerbocker Glory? Uh -huh. A Knockanori? What's that, madam? Ho, ho, ho. Uh -huh. It's a type of ice cream sundae. Can you only eat them on Sundays? Oh. Ho, ho. Not that type of sundae. You can eat them any time. Ah. I'll show you. Aha. We need ice cream, fruit, meringue, 
and cream. Peppa and George add all the ingredients into the glass. And now you can decorate the top. Then decorate with wafers, colourful sprinkles and sauce. Here you are, madam. This looks wonderful. Now everyone has been served, what kind of ice cream would you two like? Hmm. A rainbow one. Rainbow. Pepper and George use lots of different coloured ice cream. Pink for strawberry, brown for chocolate, yellow for banana, nana. Then they add their toppings. Mm -hmm. <gasps> Let's mix it all together. Um. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Pepper and George have mixed all the colours together. We've made a muddy puddle. <gasps> Not rainbow ice cream. I'm afraid we don't have much ice cream left. All we have is... Vanilla. My favourite. <laughs> Peppa and George like making special ice creams, but they love vanilla ice cream the most. A super strike for a super bowler! Today, Susie Sheep is having a bowling party. <laughs> I want to get a super strike too! I know how to do it. I've been bowling lots of times. Then you can show everyone what to do, Peppa! OK. We should take our pictures for the scoreboard. <laughs> Just step in front of the camera and say cheese. Cheese! Perfect. This is your bowling lane. <gasps> now you shoot the bowling ball. Then you throw it straight ahead. Like this. <laughs> To try. I like this one. The pink ball is very heavy. <laughs> try this one. And, and George are a bit lost. <sighs> Not to worry, George. We'll make it as long as we don't give up. Oh, hello, huh? George. The fountain is that way. By the big leafy flowers. Hooray! Off we go! Everyone has arrived at the centre of the maze. Hooray! Well done! You finished the first bit of the maze very quickly. What's the second bit? Finding your way out, of course. <laughs> Peppa and her family loved going into the very tricky hedge maze. And they're really going to love finding their way out again, too. Peppa and her family are out in the car. Oh, But they're having a bit of trouble. Oh, dear. The car won't start. You've broken down. Oh. Don't worry. I'll take you to the garage. I'll be back in a oh, jiffy. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Bull is towing the car away to be fixed. George and Pepper like being towed. Hmm. Aha! Oh dear. I see. Well, we can fix it. Oh, good. But we'll have to order a new part. It won't be easy or cheap. Oh. Oh dear, how long will it take? It will take oh, as long as it takes. But how will I get to work? There's lots of cars you can use while yours is being fixed. Follow me. There's lots of spare cars at the garage. Pick any one you like. <gasps> A motorbike. This is perfect. Oh. Let's take it for a test drive. Whee! Daddy Pig likes riding the motorbike. Hello. Oh. But motorbikes don't keep you dry in the rain. Hmm. Maybe we need something a bit tougher. Let's try this. Pepper has found a monster truck, which is very tough. Oh, <laughs> 
I think a monster truck might be a bit too tough for what we need. Sorry. What about something nice and spacious, like this bus? <laughs> ah. Mummy Pig likes the bus very much. Ooh. Ah. It's ever so roomy and peaceful. Oh dear. But everyone thinks it's a real bus. There's only one car left for Peppa and her family to try. It's a bit smelly. That's because it's my lorry for collecting the recycling. So you can't take that one, I'm afraid. I'm not sure we'll ever find a car as perfect as our car. <laughs> well, that's lucky. You took so long to pick a new car that we managed to fix your old one. Hooray! Thank you, Mr. Bull. Thank you, Grandad Dog. <laughs> Pepper's family like driving different cars, but they like driving their family car most of all. <laughs> Pepper and Susie are pretending to be police officers. <laughs> police, we'll help you. <laughs> Thanks, police officers. You're welcome. Now we must get back to solving crimes. Nino! Nino! Oh my! What is it, Madam Gazelle? I think my special pen has gone missing. <gasps> this sounds like a mystery. <gasps> Don't worry, me and police officer Susie will solve the case. <laughs> Pepper and Susie are looking for clues to find the special pen. They're using a magnifying glass to make small things look bigger. Aha! Purple! That's the wow. same colour oh. as Danny oh. Dog's T-shirt! <gasps> Have you seen oh. the special pen, Danny? I don't think so. Well, we'd better take you to the police station to ask you some questions. Pepper and Susie have made a pretend police station so they can ask everyone questions about the missing pen. <laughs> it's made from books and pillows. This police station doesn't even have doors. It's a nice place to read, though. Pepper and Susie are asking everybody about the special pen. Oh. They've brought Candy Cat to the pretend police station. Candy Cat? Can you remember what colour the special pen is? Hmm, red? No, green. Actually, pink. No, uh, blue. Aha, uh -huh. you've been very helpful. Let's take a big look around. The special blue pen must be <gasps> hidden somewhere. Pepper and Susie are searching everywhere for the special pen. Oh. But they can't find it anywhere. <laughs> I can't find it anywhere. Hmm. I have an idea. Now, Madam Gazelle is answering questions at the pretend police station. When did you last see your pen, Madam Gazelle? Well, let's see. I used it this morning. Then I put it behind my ear. Oh, my... Yay! Madam Gazelle's special pen has been behind her ear all along. We found it! We solved the mystery! <laughs> Hooray! Thank you for helping me, Peppa and Susie. I think you would make very good police officers. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her playgroup are at a juice factory. They're learning how juice is made. And this is the fruit squeezer. It squeezes all the juice out of the oranges. Can I try squeezing oranges, Miss Rabbit? Of course. You can all try. <laughs> Everyone is having lots of fun squeezing the oranges. But it is very hard work. 
that's okay, because next up, we have the Juice Stomper. Oh. The Stomper has big boots to stomp out all the juice from the strawberries. Oh, can I try stomping, Miss Rabbit? Yes, everyone can try. Hooray! Pop these boots on and stomp away. <laughs> It's just like jumping in muddy puddles. Well done, everyone. Now follow me. This is where the juice is put into cartons. We have to match the flavour with the picture on the cartons. What flavour is this one? It's red. Is it strawberry? Well done, Mandy. Press the red button to fill it up. And how about this one? It's green. So... Apple! <laughs> Spot on, Susie. And this one? It's <gasps> lots of colours. <gasps> <laughs> well done, Peppa. You've created a brand new type of juice. It's rainbow juice! <laughs> Everyone thinks the rainbow juice looks very delicious indeed. This is the tasting room. It's where we make sure all the juice tastes scrum diddly -umptious. But to make it fun, you have to guess what flavour each juice is. Peppa and her playgroup love tasting juice. This is orange juice. Mm, this is apple juice. <laughs> this tastes like all the juices at once. That's because it's your special rainbow <gasps> juice. Yum, yum, yum. Peppa loves learning about juice. And Peppa really loves her delicious rainbow juice. Today is pancake day at Peppa's playground. Ah! It's an ice cream! Can we make other pancake pictures? Yes, we can! We just need more pancake mix. Yay! <laughs> Peppa pours flour into the bowl. <laughs> Candy Cat adds an egg to the mix. Wow! Danny Dog adds the milk. And Susie Sheep gives everything a good mix. <laughs> Madam Gazelle adds food coloring to the pancake mix so they can make colorful pancake pictures. Now we can draw any pancake picture we like in the cold pan before we cook the pancake. Can you add some pink here, Susie? <laughs> and some more over here? Wow! What's it? What are you drawing, Madam Gazelle? You'll see. Now the pan will get very hot. So you must step back for this bit, children. <laughs> oh, Peppa! The pancake looks just like Peppa. I'm Peppa Pancake. <laughs> 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 and I'm really yummy. Can we make a rainbow next? Why, of course. Peppa and her friends add all the colours of the rainbow. Red. Orange. Yellow. Green. Blue. <laughs> I've ruined the rainbow pancake. <laughs> No, you haven't. All the blue has created a lovely blue sky. Can, Can I go, Let's make the 
biggest pancake in the world. Hooray! Baking powder will give us the fluffiest pancake. Just a little will do. Madam Gazelle has added more than a little baking powder. The pancake is getting bigger and bigger. Oh dear. I'm not sure we can eat this, children. Aww. But it makes a great trampoline. Pepper loves Pancake Day. Everyone loves Pancake Day. Today, Peppa and her family have been at the supermarket. Outside the supermarket is a toy machine. Yay! Ooh! Mandy Mouse has got a toy. Look, Mummy! A yo-yo! Well done, Mandy! Peppa, George, would you like a go on the toy machine? Yes, please. How does it work, Miss Rabbit? You just buy a token and put it in the slot. Then a ball rolls all the way down to the bottom of the machine and there's a special <laughs> surprise toy inside. Dinosaur! George would like to get a dinosaur toy. How fun! You can have one try each. Here you go. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> George's token makes the machine light up and play music. A ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. Whoa! Oh. George has got a toy screwdriver. A screwdriver! How useful! Dinosaur! Don't worry, George. I'll try to get the dinosaur too. Now, Pepper's token makes the machine light up and a different ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. <laughs> oh. Pepper hasn't got the dinosaur, but she has got some very nice stickers. Dinosaur! What lovely toys you got. <gasps> but look, our ice cream is starting to melt. So close. I have a feeling the dinosaur will come out next time. <laughs> Please, can we have one more go, Mommy? Please! Oh, go on then. <laughs> one more try. Hooray! <laughs> Pepper and George pull the lever on the toy machine. But this time, no balls pop out. <gasps> oh, dear. I wanted to see what toy you were going to get. Not to worry, <gasps> Mummy Pig. I can fix it. I just need to find my screwdriver. Nope. Nope. Screwdriver. <gasps> ah, thank you, George. <gasps> <gasps> Yay! <gasps> Whoops. <laughs> Miss Rabbit has fixed the machine too much. Now all the balls have fallen out. I'd better put these back, but I think you earned this for helping me fix the machine. <laughs> Dinosaur! <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This is for you. Eh? <laughs> Everyone loves the toy machine, and George really loves dinosaurs. Today, Peppa and her family have come to London to watch Super Potato, the musical. Goodness, we'd better get walking or we'll miss the start of the show. Oh no, we're going to get all wet. Not to worry, we can take the underground train instead. Hooray! The underground train is underground. It never rains underground. <laughs> And there is a colourful map that shows where all the trains go. It looks like spaghetti. So, we are here. And we need to get here. We can take the blue train first, and then... Take the red train. Yes, well done, Peppa. Off we go. First, Peppa must have her ticket checked by the ticket barrier. <laughs> Thank you, ticket robot. I'm stuck. Hold tight, Peppa. 
I'll get you out. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This way, Pepper. Follow the blue line, everyone. Um, I'm stuck too. <laughs> the train is arriving at the platform from a very dark tunnel. The train is very, very busy. Why is everybody rushing? They are in a hurry. Everyone on the underground train is in a hurry. On we go. Watch your step, everyone. Hello, everyone. Welcome aboard the blue train. Mind the doors. Hold on, Pepper. The underground train is very bumpy. <laughs> on your left, you'll see under the ground. And on your right, you'll see even more under the ground. Change here for the... Looking it for them. <laughs> Are volcanoes real, Madam Gazelle? They are. <gasps> but do not worry, children. There are no volcanoes close by. Hooray! Except the little pretend ones that we are going to make for today's very special science experiment. Oh. We will make our volcanoes using glue and newspaper. Like this. First, you dip the paper in the glue, and then you stick it all to the beaker, and voila! A volcano! Everyone is enjoying making their volcanoes. The glue is very sticky and messy. <laughs> and soon, they are all finished. <laughs> Wonderful, children! Now it is time to paint your creations. <laughs> Let's make ours red, Peppa. Ours can be blue. Green, like a big tree. Real volcanoes are dark and grey with red lava. But Peppa and her friends are making their mini volcanoes bright and colourful. <laughs> now it is time for the science experiment. But first, everyone must put on special gloves, glasses and coats to make sure they are safe. You all look like wonderful scientists, children. Now we are ready to make lava. <gasps> but do not worry. The lava we are making is just pretend and very safe. <laughs> First, we add some vinegar to our volcanoes. Be careful not to spill. Uh, uh, Perfect. And now, I will add a secret magic ingredient to each of your volcanoes. Nobody knows what the special magic ingredient is. Finally, take your cup of baking soda and pour a little inside the volcano. Then stand back! Madame Gazelle's volcano is erupting, just like a real volcano. Your turn, children. Hooray! <laughs> wow! The lava is red! Ours is blue! Candy Cat and Gerald Giraffe's lava is green and very foamy. I think we made too much lava. No, Candy. You made a muddy puddle. Everyone loves making volcanoes. But everyone really loves making colourful, muddy puddles. Today, Peppa and her friends are at the park. They're about to have a scooter race. First to that tree is the winner. Ready? Steady. Go! My wheel fell off. Oh, dear. Oh, excuse me, Mr. Bull. Do you know how to fix my scooter, please? Oh, I definitely do. I know about lots about scooters. <laughs> Mr. Bull does hmm. not know lots about scooters. Hmm, that doesn't seem right. Don't worry. I'm a bit of an expert at scooters. Daddy does know lots about scooters. Ta-da! <laughs> oh, good old. 
Do you want to race scooters with us, Mr. Bull? Um, well, the reason I don't know a lot about scooters is because I've never ridden one before. <gasps> but it's so fun! Yeah! You can go really fast! And it's much better than walking! Oh my! That does sound fun when you put it like that! We'll teach you! Just put one foot on the scooter and push forward, like this. Seems simple enough. <gasps> whoop, whoop, whoop. Remember to push forward, Mr. Bull. <laughs> hey, look at me! I'm scootering! Wahey! Yeah! <laughs> Now turn with the handlebars! You mean like this? Whee! Yes! <laughs> Yay! 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 Whoa! Oh, no! Mr. Bull doesn't know how to slow down. How do I stop? You need to use the brake, Mr. Bull! Brake? This bit? <laughs> Oh my! How fun! I want to ride down the hill again! Yay! Yay! Scootering is so much more fun than walking! <laughs> Whee! 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 Pepper and Mr. Bull are tired from going up the hill. <gasps> Going uphill is a bit more work than going down. Maybe I should go downhill again. Good idea. <laughs> Mr. Bull loves riding scooters. Everyone loves riding scooters. <laughs> Today, Pepper's playgroup are on a trip to the lake. They are going to row boats. <laughs> Whoops! Sorry, everyone! <laughs> Hello, Miss Rabbit. Hello. Are you ready to row boats today? Oh, yes. The rowing boats are just over there. Let's go. Hooray! <laughs> Everyone is wearing life jackets and helmets to keep them safe on the boats. You all look ready to get going. Pepper, Susie and Pedro, you'll be in the red rowing boat with me and Grumpy Rabbit. <laughs> and Mandy, Emily and Danny will be in the blue rowing boat with me and Captain Dog. Quick! To row the boat, you have to put this special stick called an oar in the water and pull, like this. Heave, ho! Now you try. Everyone is very excited to row the boats themselves. But no one is working together. Why isn't the boat moving, Miss Captain Rabbit? Everyone needs to row together all at once, like this. When I say heave, we push, and when I say ho, we pull. <laughs> Let's all try together. Heave, ho! Well done! Hooray! The boat is moving along the water. Everyone is working together as a team. Heave! Everyone is having lots of fun rowing their boats, but it is almost time to go home. Time to row back to shore now, children. Your parents have come to collect you. Squeak, can we race to the shore? A wonderful idea, Mandy. Is everyone ready? Ready! On your marks, get set, go! Everyone
everyone is rowing as fast as they can back to the shore. Peppa is helping her friends row as a team. Weave pond. <laughs> Weave glow. Um, believe go. Almost there. It's neck and neck. It's a draw. Well done, children. Everyone loves rowing boats, and everyone loves working as a team. Today is Pancake Day at Peppa's Playgroup. Ah. It's an ice cream! Can we make other pancake pictures? Yes, we can! We just need more pancake mix. Yay! <laughs> Peppa pours flour into the bowl. Candy Cat adds an egg to the mix. Wow! Danny Dog adds the milk. And Susie Sheep gives everything a good mix. <laughs> Madam Gazelle adds food coloring to the pancake mix so they can make colorful pancake pictures. Now we can draw any pancake picture we like in the cold pan before we cook the pancake. Can you add some pink here, Susie? <laughs> and some more over here? Wow! What is it? it? Uh-huh. <laughs> what are you drawing, Madam Gazelle? You'll see. Now the pan will get very hot. So you must step back for this bit, children. <laughs> oh, Peppa! The pancake looks just like Peppa. I'm Peppa Pancake. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm really yummy. Can we make a rainbow next? Why, of course. Peppa and her friends add all the colours of the rainbow. Red. Orange. Yellow. Green. Blue. the rainbow pancake. <laughs> no, you haven't. All the blue has created a lovely blue sky. Can I love love? Let's make the biggest pancake in the world. Hooray! Baking powder will give us the fluffiest pancake. Just a little will do. Madam Gazelle has added more than a little baking powder. The pancake is getting bigger and bigger. Oh dear. I'm not sure we can eat this, children. Aww. But it makes a great trampoline. Pepper loves pancake day. Everyone loves Pancake Day. Today, Peppa and her playgroup are doing a fun run to raise money for a new school bell. Is everybody ready to run? Ready! Okay, on your marks, get set, go! <laughs> oh, oh dear. It has started to rain, and nobody wants to run in the rain. Should we do the race another day when it's not so cloudy and rainy? Except for Peppa. But the rain will make the fun run even more fun. There'll be so many muddy puddles. Rain! All right. That means on your marks again, get set again, and... Go again. <laughs> <laughs> the rain has made a small puddle on the running track. But Rebecca Rabbit is very good at jumping. I did it! Oh. Oops! <laughs> Sorry, Rebecca. <laughs> That's okay, Peppa. Oh. Come along, you two. Lots of race to go. 
The wind is making it hard for Susie and Mummy Sheep to climb the hill. <laughs> the wind is too strong! And the hill is too slippery! Aha! Uh -huh. Ah, I know! Emily Elephant is very good at pulling things with her trunk. The way down looks very muddy. Yep, so it's fun to slide down. And Whee! Pepper is very good at sliding in the mud. Whee! <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Peppa and Daddy Pig have arrived at the big trees. Everyone must crawl under the low branches to finish the race. <laughs> <laughs> that does look fun. <laughs> Everyone has made it to the finish line. We have raised enough money to fix the school bell! Hooray! Oh, Mr. Bull will fix it tomorrow. Hooray! Did you have fun, Daddy? Daddy? Everyone loves running in the rain. Come on, Peppa. We're going again. But Daddy Pig really loves running in the rain. Hey! Everyone. Today, Pepper and Mummy Pig have come to Miss Rabbit's yoga class. Namaste, everyone! <sighs> Namaste is how you say hello in a yoga class. Please take off your shoes and find a mat. Does anyone know what yoga is? Is it where you balance on one leg? Or when you bend into funny shapes? Almost. Yoga is a fun kind of exercise that helps you feel zen. Mm. Which means relax. Oh, we'd like to be zen. Please. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let's start with some breathing. Everyone close your eyes and breathe in slowly through your nose. One, two, three. And out through your mouths. One, two, three. Everyone is finding breathing One, very two, relaxing. Three. But and Emily and her mummy's trunks One, two, are making little three. whistle sounds. <laughs> now let's do some stretching. Reach up high into the sky. <laughs> and bend down and touch your toes. Peppa, Danny and Emily are all very good at stretching. But the grown-ups are finding it a little trickier. You're very good at yoga, Mr. Bull. I've had lots of practice. And relax. <sighs> Everyone lay down on your front, then lift your chest up. This is called... Cobra pose. Oh. Is this right? That's perfect. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't need to do the sounds. Now place your hands and feet on the ground and your hips up as high as you can like this. This is oh. called downward dog. <laughs> That's perfect, Danny. You're a natural. <laughs> Finally, everyone stand up straight Put your hands together and lift one leg to the other leg. This is called tree pose. Pepper loves all the poses. <laughs> but balancing is quite hard. <laughs> Sorry, Miss Rabbit. My tree was a bit wobbly. No need to apologize, Pepper. Yoga is to help feel relaxed and zen. And nothing is more relaxing than a good giggle. Peppa loves yoga class, and Peppa really loves love. A super strike for a super bowler. 
Today, Susie Sheep is having a bowling party. <laughs> I want to get a super strike too! I know how to do it. I've been bowling lots of times. Then you can show everyone what to do, Peppa. Okay. We should take our pictures for the scoreboard. <laughs> Just step in front of the camera and say cheese. Cheese! Perfect. This is your bowling lane. Ooh. Now you shoot the bowling ball. Then you throw it straight ahead, like this. Yay! <laughs> I'm going to try. I like this one. The pink ball is very heavy. <laughs> try this one instead. It's lighter. Whoa! Crikey! Anyone lost a ball? Oh, no. I'll try next! Oh. Pedro Pony's ball has gone into the gutter at the side of the lane. Whoops! My turn! Whoa. Susie Sheep, Pedro Pony and Gerald Giraffe haven't quite got the hang of bowling yet. Don't worry, we need to find a better way to play. Hmm. Why don't you try with the barriers up this time? It's another fun way to play. Now you try, Pedro. OK, but I don't want my bowling ball to bounce. No problem. You can use a ramp to help the ball roll in a straight line. is fun! <laughs> Yay! Peppa and her friends are having lots of fun bowling in their own ways. <laughs> but Susie Sheep still wants to get a super strike. All right, everyone. It's your last bowl. Good luck! <laughs> What's this? Susie Sheep is bowling backwards. <gasps> A super strike for a super bowler! Susie Sheep has got a super strike. Susie Sheep loves bowling. Everyone loves bowling. Hello, everyone. Hello, Hello Pepper. Oh. Mummy Pig is dropping Pepper off at Playgroup. But Mummy Pig is also looking after Baby Alexander. Oh, my. Mind if I clean up Alexander's smelly nappy before I go, Madam Gazelle? I insist. <laughs> oh, can we help clean him up? Please! <laughs> OK. Can you pass me the nappy cream from the changing bag and a fresh nappy? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone likes helping Mummy Pig change baby Alexander's nappy. There, fresh as a daisy. Can baby Alexander play with us? Please! Well, I don't see why not. Hooray! Peppa is showing baby Alexander all her favourite bits of the playgroup. These are the books. <laughs> Baby Alexander likes all the books. This is the whole world. <laughs> and he enjoys spinning the globe. <laughs> and this is Madame Gazelle. Bonjour, little Alexander. Oh! But he likes Madame Gazelle most of all. Uh -huh. <laughs> Perhaps it is time for some painting. <laughs> Everyone is painting pictures of themselves, Ooh. called ah. self-portraits. I'm Peppa Paint. Hello. <laughs> Hi, Peppa. I'm Freddy. <laughs> I'm Susie. <laughs> and I'm Gerald. <laughs> well done.
done, baby Alexander. It looks like a tasty apple. <sighs> baby Alexander's painting has reminded <laughs> Pepper that it's time for lunch. It's Baby Alexander's mm. lunchtime, too. He's eating special food for babies. Here comes the train, Alexander. Choo-choo! Is Baby Alexander's food nice, Mummy? He thinks so. Oh. oh, my. Mind if I clean Alexander up again before we head off? I insist. Oh, Everyone loves having Baby Alexander at playgroup, and Baby Alexander loves visiting. <laughs> Today, Peppa and her family are at the museum. Look, George, this dinosaur has a sister, and a mummy, and a daddy. It's a whole family of dinosaurs. <laughs> Peppa loves the museum, but it is now closed. Thanks for coming. See you soon. But I don't want to leave. We don't have to leave, Peppa. Tonight, we are having a sleepover at the museum. Ooh. Hooray! Oh. oh. What shall we do first on our sleepover? Hmm. Let's have a midnight feast. Yum, yum. Dig in, everyone. Huh? Oh, this orange is rather hard. Oh. All the food in the midnight feast is made of plastic. <laughs> <laughs> what shall we do next, Peppa? Huh? Peppa? Mummy Pig can't see where Peppa has gone. Here I am. I am a Viking. <laughs> and I am a Viking. Grrr. Viking. <laughs> and I am a Viking. Uh, I mean, a woolly mammoth. <laughs> Everyone is having lots of fun running away from the woolly mammoth. But all this chasing has made everyone quite tired. Oh, I think it's time for bed. Let's find a nice spot to go to sleep. <laughs> Good night, everyone. It is now morning, and lots of visitors have come to the museum. Look at these Vikings, Granddad! Moo! What a great mammoth! It looks so lifelike! Everyone thinks Peppa and her family are part of the museum. Uh, huh? What's going on? Oh. Well, that's not a Viking! That's Peppa! Oh dear! It looks like we didn't just sleep over at the museum, but we overslept. <laughs> <laughs> it is morning, and Peppa is having some delicious breakfast. Oh. What's happened to the cereal? <laughs> April Fools! <laughs> April Fools? What's that? Today is April Fool's Day. It's a day where people make each other laugh by playing silly jokes. Like I just did with your cereal. I like silly jokes. <coughs> Can we do one on Daddy? <coughs> That's a great idea. Daddy Pig is reading on the sofa, but Mummy Pig and Pepper have come to play a joke on him. Could you please pass my glasses, Mummy Pig? Of course. Peppa and Mummy Pig are playing a joke on Daddy Pig. Thank you. <laughs> That's strange. These glasses have made it even harder to see. April Fools! <laughs> oh, these are joke glasses. Very funny. But you won't be able to play another joke on me. I am much too clever for that. Peppa
Pepper <laughs> is playing another joke on Daddy Pig. Oh no! Huh? I can't open this tube of crisps. Can you help me, Daddy? Of course, Pepper. Whoa! Oh, 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 that gave me a fright. <laughs> April Fools! <laughs> you got me again, Pepper. Well done. <laughs> Would you like to help me play an April Fool's Day joke on Mummy Pig, Pepper? <laughs> Pepper and her family have finished dinner and are now eating dessert. <laughs> Aha! Me and Pepper have made a tasty chocolate cake for dessert, haven't we, Pepper? Yes. <laughs> How lovely! It looks delicious! <laughs> <laughs> My fork doesn't seem to work. <laughs> Try with your hands. Pepper and Daddy are playing a joke on Mummy Pig. <gasps> this isn't a cake. This is a sponge with icing on it. April, April Fools! Fools. <laughs> 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 what a clever joke! That reminds me, George brought some biscuits for you, Peppa. <laughs> Yay! Thank you, George. I love biscuits. <laughs> April Fools! Peppa loves April Fools' Day. Everyone loves April Fools' Day. <laughs> Watch out! Today, Peppa and her friends are at the water park. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello, Hello Miss, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> Before you all go swimming, I have some important rules to teach you. Miss Rabbit is telling everyone how to be safe in the swimming pool. The first rule is no splashing. <laughs> no splashing, Mr Bull. Whoops! Sorry, Peppa! Sorry, Miss Rabbit! That's okay, Mr. Bull. The second rule is no running. <laughs> Silly, Mr. Bull. No running. Sorry again. Mr. Bull doesn't know any of the rules. And the last rule is. Everyone must have a simply splendid time. Oh! Ooh. Have a splendid time, Mr. Bull. Oh, ho, ho, ho! Right you are, Pepper! Enjoy the pool, everyone. What shall we do first? Let's go on the water slide. Hooray! Everyone is very excited to ride the water slides. <laughs> Hello again! Who wants to go down the slide? Me! Well, well, you're in luck. There is one slide for each of you. Let's have a race! Good idea! Lucky I brought my flag. On your marks, get set, go! And Danny Dog zooms into the lead. Followed by Peppa. Then it's Gerald Giraffe and Susie Sheep coming up behind. It's incredibly close. Water slide racing at its best. Hello, Granny. Hello, Mr. Bull. Oh. Oh. They're nearly at the finish line. It's neck and neck. Who will come out on top? It's... A draw! Everybody wins! <laughs> Peppa and her friends love the slides, but they have forgotten the first rule of the water park. Oh. Uh -huh. No, no splashing! Today, the cruise has stopped on an island, so Pepper and Granny Pig can go surfing. 
but there aren't any waves. Where did all the waves go? It looks like the water is too calm for surfing today, Peppa. You can help me and George collect shells instead, if you like. Shiny! Hey. Oh, hello, everyone! What? I have a little paddle boat if you want to try it, Peppa. Oh! Peppa is very <laughs> excited to try the paddle boat. Yes, please! <laughs> and Granny Pig can ride with me on my jet ski. Oh, but um, Granny Pig isn't sure she'll uh, enjoy Miss Rabbit's jet ski. Uh, Peppa and Granny Pig have put on some life jackets oh. and helmets to keep safe. Now they are ready to ride on the water. Peppa's paddle boat has pedals to make it go. That's right, Peppa. Pedal forwards to make the boat move forward. <laughs> Does it go Off any we go. <laughs> Have you found any colourful <laughs> shells, George? <laughs> oh, this one's perfect. <laughs> Wonderful. George is finding lots of shells oh. on the beach. <laughs> How about we use the shells to make a picture? Peppa is having lots of fun out on the water. <laughs> <laughs> but Granny Pig is looking rather seasick. <laughs> George has made a dinosaur out of shells. Ooh, dinosaur! How clever! It just needs one more special shell for the eye. Well done, George. <laughs> Miss Rabbit's wave has washed George's shells back into the sea. Hello, oh. George. Hello, Grandpa. <laughs> oh, dear. But look, your special shiny shell is still here. Shiny! Wow! I like your sand dinosaur picture, George. George's <laughs> shells have left a dinosaur shape in the sand. Dinosaur! Peppa loves having fun at the beach. Everyone loves having fun at the beach. Not rainbow ice cream. I'm afraid we don't have much ice cream left. All we have is... Vanilla! My favourite! Peppa and George like making special ice creams, but they love vanilla ice cream the most. Today, Peppa and her family have been at the supermarket. Outside the supermarket is a toy machine. Yay! Ooh! Mandy Mouse has got a toy. Look, Mummy! A yo-yo! Well done, Mandy! Peppa, George, would you like a go on the toy machine? Yes, please. How does it work, Miss Rabbit? You just buy a token and put it in the slot. Then a ball rolls all the way down to the bottom of the machine and there's a special <laughs> surprise toy inside. Dinosaur! George would like to get a dinosaur toy. How fun! You can have one try each. Here you go. Yay! <laughs> Yay! George's token makes the machine light up and play music. A ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. Whoa! Oh. George has got a toy screwdriver. A screwdriver! How useful! Dinosaur! Don't worry, George. I'll try to get the dinosaur too. Now, Pepper's token makes the machine light up and a different ball rolls all the way down to the bottom. <laughs> oh. Pepper hasn't got the dinosaur, but she has got some very nice stickers. Dinosaur! What lovely toys you got. 
<gasps> but look, our ice cream is starting to melt. So close. I have a feeling the dinosaur will come out next time. <laughs> Please, can we have one more go, Mommy? Please? Oh, go on then. <laughs> one more try. Hooray! <laughs> Pepper and George pull the lever on the toy machine. But this time, no balls pop out. <gasps> oh dear. I wanted to see what toy you were going to get. Not to worry, <gasps> Mummy Pig. I can fix it. I just need to find my screwdriver. Nope. Nope. Screwdriver. <gasps> ah, thank you, George. <gasps> Oh, whoops! <laughs> Miss Rabbit has fixed the machine too much. Now all the balls have fallen out. I'd better put these back, but I think you earned this for helping me fix the machine. <laughs> Dinosaur! <laughs> Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This is for you. Eh? <gasps> <laughs> Everyone loves the toy machine, and George really loves dinosaurs. Dinosaurs! Today, dinosaurs! Mummy Pig has brought dinosaurs! Peppa and George for a special <laughs> visit to the toy shop. Hello! I'm looking for a mummy and two little ones for a special toy shop treat. Have you seen them? <gasps> That's us! Is it? Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go! Hooray! Oh! This Whoa. is where you're able to create your very own special toy. Ooh. Just swipe through to choose. You could pick a robot or a princess or a silly monster or a... <gasps> dinosaur! <laughs> oh, I didn't know you liked dinosaurs. Dinosaur! 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 <laughs> George loves dinosaurs. They're his Favorite. I guess we know what he'll be making. Have fun! Yay! Ooh, <laughs> good choice. <laughs> Lovely. A spaceman, a monster, a superhero. Pepper and George <laughs> love making their own toys. They both like very different things. Mine is a robot. Dinosaur! Fantastic! Now with a little toy shop magic, <laughs> the machine will make your toys! Lovely! <laughs> now you just need to pick an outfit for your toys. <laughs> there are lots of different outfits to choose from, but Peppa and George think oh. these outfits are perfect for their new toys. <laughs> Hooray! Perfect! In they go! Oh dear, the toy machine has put the wrong clothes on the toys. The machine mixed up their clothes, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> oh yes. Ah oh, well, they still look like fun toys to me. And very creative. <laughs> Flying is fun. Whee! <laughs> Wait for us, Peppa. Whee! Wow, what is this room? This is a special new toy machine. Whoa. Just stand here in the middle, Peppa. <laughs> what is it doing? Stay still. What was that? <gasps> Ta-da! The machine has made a little toy that looks just <laughs> like Peppa. Look, George, I'm tiny. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Are you? <laughs> Peppa and George love making toys in the toy shop, but George really loves being a toy too. Today, Peppa and her classmates are visiting a chocolate factory. Can I try some chocolate, please, Miss Rabbit? You can, Peppa. Yay! But we've got to make it first. Oh. <laughs> Peppa is very excited to make chocolate. How do we make it, Miss Rabbit? With this machine. Hello, machine. Can you make me some chocolate, please? <gasps> Thank you, machine. Yay! 
Now can I try some of it, please? Not yet, Peppa. We need to decorate it first. Follow me! <laughs> Everyone is very excited to decorate the chocolate, too. You can decorate one chocolate bar each. Ooh, it looks like a muddy puzzle. <laughs> yes, but don't jump in it, Peppa. And you can add whatever decorations you like from the table as long as it's yummy. Mine is a carroty chocolate bar. <laughs> Squeak! Delicious! Mine is a cheesy chocolate bar. Squeak! Yum, yum! And mine is a spaghetti chocolate bar. Oh. Because strawberry laces look like spaghetti. <laughs> Phew! Scrumptious! Can I try some chocolate now, please, Miss Rabbit? Almost, Peppa. The chocolate needs to cool in the fridge first. The fridge is very cold and makes the liquid chocolate harden into bars. And done! <laughs> Can we please try some chocolate now, Miss Rabbit? Not yet, Pep. Oh, wait! Yes, you can! <gasps> Delicious! <laughs> Scrumptedly action! Squeak! Hmm, is something wrong, Peppa? No, I just really liked it when the chocolate was all runny like a muddy puddle. Oh, ho, ho. then it's lucky I have one more treat for you Yay! all! It's... <laughs> It's just like a giant chocolate muddy puddle. And lots of nice healthy fruit to dip too. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. <laughs> Peppa loves muddy puddles, especially when they're made out of chocolate. <laughs> 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 Today, Peppa and her family are visiting the arcade. Well done! You got a high score. That's because Peppa and I are experts at all of these games. Look at all these tokens, Peppa. If you collect lots of these, you can trade them in for a huge prize. Wow, a prize? Squeak! Look at all these tokens! <laughs> can we play that game next? Of course, Peppa. Mummy Pig is showing Peppa how to play Carrot Bop. She is bopping the carrots whenever they pop up. Bop! 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 <laughs> Would you both like to have a go? Yes, please. <laughs> More token? Does this mean we can get a really big prize, Daddy? Daddy? <laughs> Daddy Pig is playing the dancing game. Daddy Pig loves dancing. Wow! I'm a... Uh... Bit of an expert at dancing, you know. Your turn, Peppa. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Phew, that was fun. But is there a game we can play all together? I know just the game. <laughs> Peppa and her family are playing a balloon game. Whoever fills their balloon with water first wins. Did we get another high score? Yes! Your score was so high that you have all won the jackpot. Now you can trade in all your tokens for a huge prize. Hooray! Let's go! Hello again, Peppa. Here are all our tokens. Can we please have our prize? 
Of course! With this many tokens, you can get a marvelous, extraordinary, one of a kind pencil. Hooray! A pencil! Peppa loves winning lots of tokens with her family at the arcade, and Peppa really loves her brand new pencil. Today, Peppa and her family have come to London to watch Super Potato, the musical. Goodness, we'd better get walking or we'll miss the start of the show. Oh no, we're going to get all wet. Not to worry, we can take the underground train instead. Hooray! The underground train is underground. It never rains underground. <laughs> And there is a colourful map that shows where all the trains go. It looks like spaghetti. So, we are here. And we need to get here. We can take the blue train first, and then... Take the red train. Yes, well done, Pepper. Off we go! First, Pepper must have her ticket checked by the ticket barrier. Oink. <laughs> Thank you, ticket robot. I'm stuck. Hold tight, Peppa. I'll get you out. Thank you, Miss Rabbit. This way, Peppa. Follow the blue line, everyone. Um, I'm stuck too. <laughs> The train is arriving at the platform from a very dark tunnel. The train is very, very busy. Why is everybody rushing? They are in a hurry. Everyone on the underground train is in a hurry. On we go. Watch your step, everyone. Hello, everyone. Welcome aboard the blue train. Mind the doors. Hold on, Pepper. The underground train is very bumpy. <laughs> on your left, you'll see under the ground. And on your right, you'll see even more under the ground. Change here for the red train. The red train? That's us. Watch your step, George. Hold tight, everyone! <laughs> we're here! We're here! The show starts in a few minutes. We might miss the beginning. Oh, no, you won't. Follow me. I'll get you to Super Potato the Musical on time, or my name isn't... Super Potato! Hooray! <laughs> Big celebrity coming through! Make way for the star, thank you! <laughs> no autographs today! Super Potato is in a hurry, too! Everyone on the underground train is in a hurry! Today, Pepper and George are going for a picnic with <laughs> Granny and Grandpa Pig! <laughs> Nearly there! <Whoa. laughs> it's Pepper's first time being in charge of packing the picnic! Are you okay, Pepper? I need to bring all my toys for the picnic, but they won't fit. Hmm, do you need all of your toys? Uh, I know. I can just bring Teddy instead. Dinosaur! <laughs> and dinosaur. Wonderful. We won't have space for the food if we bring all your toys. What kind of food would you like to make for the picnic, Pepper? Oh, let's make spaghetti. I love spaghetti. Spaghetti is not very good picnic food. How about sandwiches? I love sandwiches too. <laughs> what is your favorite kind of sandwich? Jam! <laughs> Pepper, George, and Granny Pig are making Yay! jam sandwiches. Will we need anything else for the picnic, Pepper? Um, we need a comfy picnic blanket. Can you find one, Grandpa? Aye, aye, Pepper. <laughs> ah. 
Oh no! Making jam sandwiches is very messy. And cleaning the mess has made an even bigger mess. Not to worry. You can't make jam sandwiches without getting a little jammy. <laughs> Pepper's sandwiches are triangles. Ta-da! And George's are dinosaurs. <laughs> Got the blanket. Do we need anything else, Pepper? We need cups for our orange juice. Well done, Pepper. Looks like we're ready to go. This is going to be so much fun. Oh no, it's raining. Picnics are not as fun in the rain. Oh dear, I think our outdoor picnic will have to wait, oh. Pepper. Oh. But why don't we have an indoor picnic instead? Yay! Peppa has set up her picnic indoors. Now we can have a picnic even when it's raining. And all my toys can come too. Picnic! <laughs> Everyone loves Peppa's picnic and Peppa loved Peppa. Paddy Bull, A Star Plus. Oh, hooray! We've landed! Whee! Already? But I was having fun! That wasn't scary at all! I told you, flying is really fun! Thank you for helping me, Peppa and George. Now I cannot wait to fly home! <laughs> <laughs> Today, Peppa and her friends are at the water park. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello, Hello Miss Rabbit. Before you all go swimming, I have some important rules to teach you. Miss Rabbit is telling everyone how to be safe in the swimming pool. The first rule is no splashing. <laughs> No splashing, Mr. Bull. Whoops! Sorry, Pepper. Sorry, Miss Rabbit. That's okay, Mr. Bull. The second rule is no running. <laughs> Silly, Mr. Bull. No running. Sorry again. Mr. Bull doesn't know any of the rules. And the last rule is, everyone must have a simply splendid time. Oh! Ooh. Have a splendid time, Mr. Bull. Oh, ho, ho, ho! Right you are, Peppa! Enjoy the pool, everyone! What shall we do first? Let's go on the water slide! Hooray! <laughs> Everyone is very excited to ride the water slide. Hello again! Who wants to go down the slide? Me! Well, you're in luck. There is one slide for each of you. Let's have a race! Good idea! Lucky I brought my flag. On your marks, get set, go! And Danny Dog zooms into the lead, followed by Peppa. Then it's Gerald Giraffe and Susie Sheep coming up behind. It's incredibly close. Water slide racing at its best. Hello, Danny. Hello, Mr. Bull. Oh. oh. They're nearly at the finish line! It's neck and neck! Who will come out on top? It's... A draw! Everybody wins! Peppa and her friends love the slides, but they have forgotten the first rule of the water park. Uh -huh. No splashing! Who's 
ready for an adventure to the seaside. Hooray! Peppa and her family are going out for the day. Oh dear, I think I forgot to put petrol in the car. Never mind. Let's take the train to the beach. Hooray! Peppa and her family are catching a train to the seaside. Tickets, please. We're going to the seaside. And Mummy didn't put petrol in the car. How exciting! <laughs> I love the seaside. I think it's time for some lunch. Peppa, <laughs> let's look for the dining carriage. <laughs> Daddy Pig and Peppa are walking through the train to the dining carriage. It is very wobbly. This carriage must be for passengers who want to sleep. <laughs> Whoa! This carriage must be for people who want to play on the train. Wow! Hi, Danny! Hi, Gerald! <laughs> Whee! <laughs> uh -oh. Oh. This must be the cinema carriage. Excuse, Excuse me. me. Peppa and Daddy Pig have found the dining carriage. <sighs> this carriage must be for people who want lunch. <laughs> Is that your tummy rumbling, Daddy? I'm afraid the train has broken down. Oh dear, we'll have to take the bus. Now, Peppa's family are waiting to catch the bus uh, to the seaside. Uh -huh. oh. All aboard! <laughs> Next stop, the seaside! Hooray! <laughs> The bus has broken oh. down. I think somebody forgot petrol again. <laughs> now how will we get to the seaside? Well, we can walk. The seaside is just down the hill. This was the best trip to the seaside ever. I can't wait to see how we get back home. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Peppa and her friends are going to play on the seesaw. <laughs> Stop! Oh. <laughs> Is there a problem, Mr. Bull? Just finishing fixing the seesaw, Daddy Pig. There, now it's safe as houses and ready to go. Hooray! Peppa loves playing on the seesaw. Will you play with me, Mr. Bull? It's fun. Me? Why not? It is fixed and ready after all. Whee! <laughs> <laughs> well, that was fun. How are you going to get down? You need to go up so Peppa can come down. Oh, like this? Whee! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Bull is stuck at the bottom of the seesaw. Mr. Bull is a grown-up and Peppa is small, so the seesaw won't balance. You need something heavy on Peppa's side. Blimey, how do you know that? I am a clever clog. <laughs> Righto then. Peppa's backpack will make ah. her heavier. Ah. <laughs> up, 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 up. <laughs> we are as high as the clouds. <laughs> Mr. Bull is still stuck oh. at the bottom of the seesaw. I suppose it's good fun at the bottom too. What a cracking view of the grass. <laughs> We need another grown-up to play with, Mr. Bull. Meow. Hmm. I wonder where we can find another grown-up. You're a grown-up, Daddy. 
Oh, yes, so I am. I'll play with you, Mr. Bull. Ah. Yay! Whoa! <laughs> Daddy Pig Whoa. and Mr. Bull are both grown-ups. So the seesaw is balanced and goes up and down. Stop! Are you not having fun, Mr. Bull? I'm having a brilliant time. I just wanted to see the view. Okie dokie, let's go! Whee! Up into the sky! Hello, sun! Hello, grass! Hello, clouds! <laughs> Hello, pepper! <laughs> Today, Pepper and George are going for a picnic with Granny and Grandpa Pig. Nearly there! <laughs> it's Pepper's first time being in charge of packing the picnic. Are you okay, Pepper? I need to bring all my toys for the picnic, but they won't fit. Hmm. Do you need all of your toys? Uh. I know. I can just bring Teddy instead. Dinosaur! <laughs> and dinosaur. Wonderful. We won't have space for the food if we bring all your toys. What kind of food would you like to make for the picnic, Pepper? Oh, let's make spaghetti. I love spaghetti. Spaghetti is not very good picnic food. How about sandwiches? I love sandwiches too. <laughs> what is your favorite kind of sandwich? Jam! <laughs> Pepper, George, and Granny Pig are making Yay! jam sandwiches. Will we need anything else for the picnic, Pepper? Um, we need a comfy picnic blanket. Can you find one, Grandpa? Aye, aye, Pepper. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Making jam sandwiches is very messy. And cleaning the mess has made an even bigger mess. Not to worry. You can't make jam sandwiches without getting a little jammy. <laughs> Pepper's sandwiches are triangles. Ta-da! And George's are dinosaurs. <laughs> Got the blanket. Need anything else, Pepper? Mm. We need cups for our orange juice. Well done, Pepper. Looks like we're ready to go. This is going to be so much fun. Oh no, it's raining. Picnics are not as fun in the rain. Oh dear, I think our outdoor picnic will have to wait, oh. Pepper. Oh. But why don't we have an indoor picnic instead? Yay! Pepper has set up her picnic indoors. Now we can have a picnic even when it's raining. And all my toys can come too. Picnic! <laughs> Everyone loves Pepper's picnic and Pepper loved packing it. It is dinner time. But dinner has been burned. Oh dear, do you think we can still eat it? <laughs> I think we should treat ourselves to a takeaway. Hooray! We choose what kind of food we like and it gets delivered to our house. There's Chinese takeaway, Indian takeaway or sushi. Can we have this one please? Pepper wants to order Chinese takeaway. Let's have this and this. And don't forget the special surprise. Ah. Pepper and her family have ordered lots of delicious food. <laughs> what happens now? Well, first the restaurant has to cook the food and then they'll deliver it. Oh, but how do they know where we live? I gave them our address when we ordered the takeaway. But how will it get here? Miss Rabbit will bring it on her bike. Oh, look! She's nearly here. 
Let's go and find her! <laughs> huh? Pepper and George have gone to the wrong door. Oh. It's here! <laughs> Here's your takeaway, Pepper. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you. Got to dash. Lots of food to deliver. Rice, noodles, vegetable rolls. And a special Ooh. surprise for afterwards. Ah. Pepper and George don't know what the special <laughs> surprise is. Mmm, I love rice. Mm. Mm. And I love my spicy noodles. They're my favourite. Ooh, they might be my favourite too. Can I try some? Yes, but just try a tiny bit. Mmm, I love noodles. Oh, but they are a bit spicy. Spicy noodles are not Pepper's favourite. Here, try a vegetable spring roll. Mmm, vegetable spring rolls are my favourite. <laughs> Pepper and her family have finished their Chinese takeaway. Are you ready for the special surprise? Hooray! These are called fortune cookies. They have a special message inside that brings you good luck. Ooh. This good luck tastes amazing. Peppa loves Chinese takeaway. <laughs> Everyone loves Chinese takeaway. <laughs> Today, Mummy and Peppa have brought George Yay! to the doctors for a checkup. Hello, I'm Dr. Peppa Pig. <laughs> Hello, Dr. Peppa Pig. I'm Nurse Miss Rabbit. And this is Dr. Brown Bear. Ready for your checkup, George? No! George has never been to the doctors before. He is a little nervous. Don't worry, George. The doctors just want to make sure you feel good. Exactly. Come on in and don't forget your little red book. <laughs> First, Miss Rabbit and Dr. Brown Bear need to check George's height. Step this way, please, George. No! But George isn't sure he'll like the height measurer. How tall am I, Miss Rabbit? Wow! You're getting very tall, Peppa. You'll be a big grown-up soon. <laughs> George wants to know if he is very tall, too. Wow! You're so big and tall, George. Now it's time to check George's weight with a special machine called Scales. This machine will tell us how much you weigh, George. And it's really good for bouncing. <laughs> George loves bouncing. <laughs> and freeze. <gasps> Mm hmm. And unfreeze. <laughs> now it's time to listen to George's heart with a special tool called a stethoscope. Oh. Oh. This might be a little cold. <laughs> the stethoscope is very cold. Oh. Try this, George. You can listen to my heartbeat too. George likes listening to Peppa's heart. <laughs> Yay! You did very well today, George. So you get a sticker. Oh. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> and one for Dr. Pepper Pig for being so helpful too. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> Hello everyone, I'm Pepper, the dentist. 
I'll help you look after your teeth. Whoa! Today, Miss Rabbit has come to teach Peppa's playgroup about teeth. Peppa is pretending she is a dentist. <laughs> Got you. For you. Thank you, Peppa. Well, now that you've caught your teeth, <laughs> who knows what we can do to look after them? Um... <sighs> Go to the dentist? That's right. Who has been to the dentist before? Me, 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 me. Gerald Giraffe has not been to the dentist before. Can I show Gerald what it's like at the dentist, Miss Rabbit? I've been lots of times. What a great idea! <laughs> Peppa is pretending she is the dentist, and Gerald is the patient. Hello, Mr. Gerald. Please sit on this enormous chair. <laughs> Thank you, Mrs. Dentist. Here is your apron. <laughs> Why do I need glasses, Mrs. Pepper? For this big light. Please open wide like this. Ah! So I can see your teeth. Ah! Pepper is using the torch to see Gerald's teeth. You have very nice teeth, Mr. Gerald. So you get a sticker. Thank you. <laughs> Well done, Pepper and Gerald. Does anyone know a way we can look after our teeth at home? Um, uh, we can brush our teeth. That's right, Susie. Brushing our teeth keeps them clean. Shall we practice brushing our teeth? Yes! Miss Rabbit is giving everyone toothbrushes so they can practice brushing their teeth. First, we get the brush wet. <laughs> then we put some toothpaste on. Everyone is adding little dollops of toothpaste to their toothbrush. But Candy has added a big dollop. Now what do we do, class? We... Brush! <laughs> Remember to brush the front and the sides, tops and bottoms. Well done, everyone. <laughs> everyone did very well today, so everyone gets stickers. Peppa likes pretending to be a dentist, and Peppa really likes stickers. Today, it is show and tell at Peppa's playgroup. <laughs> Keep practicing, Peppa. You'll get the hang of it soon. Thank you, Susie. You make a wonderful starfish. <laughs> now, it is Peppa's turn. I am the Amazing Mysterio. And I am the Amazing Pepper O. <laughs> and we are going to show you some really <laughs> magical magic. <laughs> ah! Amazing Mr. O, please pass me my top hat. Um, you're wearing it, Pepper. <laughs> Oh, yes. <laughs> now I will pull a toy rabbit out of it. <laughs> the toy rabbit is still on Pepper's head. Abracadabra fiddly bop. <gasps> Daddy, I can't find the toy rabbit. Oh, there it is. Ta da! <laughs> Time for my next trick. Would you like some flowers, Madam Gazelle? I would love some, Peppa. For her next trick, Peppa is going to make some flowers appear. Abracadabra, biddly boy. <laughs> Abracadabra, biddly boy. Ho, 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 ho. That does tickle. <laughs> Why don't you try the magic ring trick, Peppa? I mean, 
Amazing Pepper O. Good idea, Daddy. Uh, I mean, Amazing Mysterio. Pepper is going to make the two rings join together with magic. Abracadabra, biddly bob. It is quite hard to magically join the rings together. <gasps> And a bit messy. I don't think I'm very good at magic, Daddy. Yes, you are. You're the amazing Pepper O. You can do it, Pepper. <laughs> okay, Daddy. <laughs> Abracadabra, biddly bang. <laughs> Marvelous magic show! Well done, Peppa. You are a true magician. Thank you. And for our last trick, we will disappear. Bye bye. <gasps> Peppa loves magic tricks. Everyone loves magic tricks. <laughs> Today, Peppa is having a play date at home with Susie Sheep and Emily Elephant. George is also having a play date with Edmund Elephant and Richard Rabbit. Perhaps we should have arranged these play dates for different days. Hooey! Only us! Yay! <laughs> we'll come back later. Make a castle out of blocks! Peppa and her friends have decided to play with colourful building blocks. But George and his friends have decided to play something a little noisier. Oh no! A dinosaur! Run! George loves to play dinosaur. <laughs> Not too fast, George. Almost! Got it? <laughs> but George isn't being very careful. Are you all right, Peppa? Yep, I'm okay. <gasps> Our castle. Oh dear, George feels very sorry for breaking Peppa's castle. It's okay. It was just an accident. Maybe it'd be nice to play all together. Yay! <laughs> I know a game we can play. Everyone helps Pepper set up the game. Phew. <laughs> oh. And George gives everyone special costumes. Finally, everyone is ready to play. Oh dear, we need help. Are there any brave knights here? Oh. Do you need help, Mrs. Queen? Don't worry, we'll stop them with magic. <laughs> Everyone loves having play dates with Pepper and George. Oh. Perhaps tomorrow then. And everyone really loves playing all together. Pepper, have you decided what you're giving away to the charity shop? Yes. All of this. Whoa. Today, Peppa is giving some of her toys and clothes to a charity shop. This is called donating. <gasps> Away we go! Whee! Charity shops sell donated items and use the money to help people. Great! Do you want to help me sell them? Yes, please! I'll help by shopping. <laughs> Peppa is excited for people to buy her old things. <gasps> oh. But no one is buying them. No one is buying any of the things I donated, Miss Rabbit. Not to worry. 
We just need to let people know they're available to buy. <laughs> like this. Do you like toy rabbits, police officer panda? Yes. Did you want to buy this one? <gasps> I do. Thank you. Why don't you try, Peppa? <gasps> I'm a bit cold, <gasps> Mummy. Would you like to buy this jumper, Susie? It's very warm and woolly and cosy. <laughs> yes, please. I love wool. Bonjour, Miss Rabbit. I'm looking for a gift for somebody who loves sports. Hmm. I know. Hmm. <gasps> Catch. <laughs> this is perfect. Thank you. Oh. Peppa wants to sell her <laughs> toy bus next, but there's no one left to sell to. There's no one left in the shop, Miss Rabbit, mm -hmm. except <gasps> Mummy. Let's put it in the window display so everyone outside can see it. Yay! <laughs> Hello there. Look at this toy bus. Would you like to buy it? No one can hear Peppa from outside the shop. The big real bus looks just like Peppa's little toy bus. <gasps> we have the same bus. Maybe it'll sell tomorrow, Peppa. <gasps> Yay! Excuse me, is that toy bus for sale? <gasps> Why, yes it is. Would you like to buy it? I would <laughs> love to buy it. I love all buses, big and small. Hooray! Peppa loves the charity shop. Everyone <gasps> loves the charity shop. <laughs>